we have the upper prison right here. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, so I think that's uh, that's potentially like a road trip waiting to happen. Oh yeah, we should like, you know, rent a cargo van, schlep everybody into it, and go off and. Uh, I, gonna... Actually, I don't know if I ever told you about the spa in Moose Jaw. The spa in Moose Jaw? Yeah. Moose Jaw was Al Capone's Canadian hideout. Because um, no one looks for you in Moose Jaw. There's exactly. Only... And it's almost an abandoned town, so there you go. Exactly. So when the heat was on for Capone, he used to come up to Canada and hide out in Moose Jaw sure. in an abandoned train yard. Did they, did they brew liquor and stuff there too, do you think? Uh, they very well might likely have. Um, so anyways, this particular place's claim to fame was the fact that it had all kinds of underground tunnels, okay. including access to uh, a natural spring. So now, uh, we passed a lore master who just said hi to us. Didn't uh, see <laughs> Oh, they're there. I see them over here. Okay. Yeah, I heard, I heard the... Uh... Oh, neat. All right, well, let's see what he's got to say, huh? Yeah. And thus, my prayers are answered. None too soon, neither. Don't look so perplexed, Exile. It's simple. God has sent you to help me look after the relics, the few remaining islands of faith in this sea of sin. The corrupted, they hunger to see faith gone for good, chewed up and spat out by the nightmare. Not while you and I live and breathe, right, Exile? Right. Any moment now, this holy spot's going to be buried in filth. The corrupted will pour in here, bent on eclipsing anything and everything that has been touched by divinity. I hope you're good with the shovel, Exile. <laughs> Glory to the pure and mercy to the fallen. Buddy, I got a silver shovel. You don't know me at all. Oh, wow. So, baddies. So anyways, this uh, this particular uh, train uh, station had all kinds of underground tunnels, including a natural spring. Okay. Um, so they subsequently turned it into a natural spring spa. Uh, all right. But okay. several kilometers of the tunnels are available for exploration. Several kilometers? Yes. Now, how, how tight do you think, or how... Like, how tight of a space do you think, do you suppose that would be? I don't know, to be honest. Um, I, I don't imagine it's very tight because, you know, it's open for the public and, you know, there's certain liability issues. But yeah, I'm yeah, thinking, yeah. like, what better vacation than, hey, ladies, why don't you go hang out in the natural spa pool and uh, we'll go find something to entertain ourselves with. Shut the front door! For sure, we could go on a dungeon crawl and then get their nails done! <laughs> exactly! And then we could switch! There you go. Jade Chopper, Big Axe, Goat Horn, New Spirit. Okay, so this guy's probably got something more to say here. That was some damn divine slaughter you delivered there, Crusader. <laughs> yeah, did God proud today. You come visit me in Lion Eyes Watch next time you're there, for I'm more crusading where that came from. Right. Have you noticed that apparently the only criminals in this game world are of the British Islands? Yeah, yeah. Like I, I, I think like the Marauder type guy or the the Armor Master. He sounded vaguely like like an Aussie or a, yep. or a Kiwi maybe. Yeah. Yeah, I, 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 I get the feeling that this this is Australia. Oh really? Eh. Yeah. Well, we you know we've we've been sent to the uh, to the colonies or, or or the Exile Isles, right? Pretty much. Yeah. Okay. I'll go with that. Crikey. No gators, though. But then again, yeah, all the screwy wildlife. Yeah, also exactly. screams of Australia. The uh, indigenous population is proving to be quite difficult. Yeah. Uh, perhaps less so than real Australia. And to my Australian friends who are watching this and don't think that stuff's funny, I'm a little sorry. Only because it wasn't funnier. Cool. Exactly. That's, no, I got a few of those. But yeah, there you go. Destination of the stars. Going to scenic moose job for the honeymoon. Exactly. <laughs> That's fantastic. They don't even have to make fun of us back. We make fun of ourselves. But you know, here's the deal, right? I bet your airfare to moose jaw is, is cheaper than dirt. Oh, yeah. That particular spa might cost a little bit of money. But otherwise, 
Uh, we're looking for a chamber to kill this guy, and I'm gonna stop talking and start playing the game. Oh, and the scary bridge? There you are. Hey, sweet. Just in time to kill a bad guy. But yeah, really, like, sure, they'd probably ding you a little bit for the hotel f fare and stuff, but, like, how expensive could it be to hang out a moose jaw? Exactly! I mean, these guys can't make change for a toonie, I mean... Ooh, saw bones. I wonder what moose jaw actually does. You know what I mean? I'm like a necromancer, not a miracle worker. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Oh, and you'll notice how we've been ragging Moose Jaw for ten minutes, and I apologize to the Australians. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Hopefully, we have no viewers in Moose Jaw. Sunny, sunny moose. Jaw. Are there are there any viewers in Moose Jaw? You want this light brigandine at least for loot? I do. Uh, I'm gonna find a way to pick it up. Are we ready to go? Rock and roll. Okay, so we're looking for upper chambers, presumably to kill the prison warden, right? Here we go, the warden's quarters. Dun dun dun. All right, and then. Indeed, sir. Thank you for waiting on me. You're awesome. Ooh. These cells are much smaller. Well, I'm thinking down here. Yeah. Oh. oh, there we go. An exile here. A shame the warden won't leave anything for me to examine. Make sure you tell our host that piety of Theophilus sends her regards. Can you spell that for me? <laughs> I don't think we can go in and talk to her. She just hangs out in there. Oh, but she's got a journal. I want the journal. Yeah, let's uh, work our way in there. Well, I think we can. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta work around. our way around. You're right. Which, if you want to do, is probably back up this way. Yep. I feel like I might regret this. Chavron's journal. Okay, let's touch it. Still, the Kaurui barbarians advance from the south. Lion Eye is dead. His legion slaughtered. Should the need arise, we shall retreat through Prisoner's Gate. Raising my barricade behind us. But our Lord Brutus nears readiness. Foul times demand heroism. The warden will serve as our savior. May he crush the Karui into the sand with the mighty fists I shall gift to. Wait a minute, haven't we been working for a guy that's collecting Karui spirits? Yep. I feel like we're in the middle of something. Yeah. That's something it... ancient and dangerous, David. Also a giant scary prison. We're probably in the middle of one of those two. Yes. I'm just going to follow the drag blood trails here, because apparently it's not hard to find our way. Oh, yeah. There we go. Warden's, the warden's Chambers. Dun-dun-dun. You ready? You're all geared up. All right, uh, let's powers do it. Let's oh. do it. I'll break it down. Oh, yeah. It closed. Here's the warden. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it seems like just straight meat is going to be the way to go here. Oh, he's, he's got some spike traps. Move out of there. Oh, yeah. No oh, kidding. and baddies. And now apparently I'm trying to tweet again. Okay, whoa. Selfie with the warden. Hashtag boss fight. Hashtag resurrecting. Oh, but it's right outside the door. Fantastic. Uh, that was gross, man. Yes! Eat it, man! Eat it! Mercy killing! Achievement get! Check that out. And that's all the shouting I'm allowed to do today, because I have a baby. So... <laughs> Alright. You got the yellow iron greaves? Excellent. Um, oh no! Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna pause here for a second while we agonize over looting. How's that sound, bud? Sounds good. Well, there we go. After much shuffling of our bags, looks like... The prison gate is now open, the cage brute. You have killed Brutus and unlocked the prison's exit. Search for it in the warden's chambers in the upper prison. So that looks like the last little thing we need to do here. I need more pockets. No, no, you need to have a developer that gives you more than nine slots to carry 8,000 items. <laughs> I'm saying. Okay, so I bet you entirely instinctively went the right direction instantly. Prisoner's gate, found it. 
Okay. Ooh, there's a spider. Where's the spider? I don't know. There's a little animation. There's If you watch the prison gate, there's a little spider that scurries around. Okay. Travel to the prison gate. Well, let's, let's click through this and finish off the way forward, I guess, eh? Talk to Tarkley for your reward. Excellent. Okay. Well, you know what, my friends? It's uh, getting on in our part of the world, and uh, Dave has been tolerating my foolishness and keeping me alive for long enough. So... I want to thank you guys very much for hanging out with us and watching some more uh, Path of Exile. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, you probably should. We do a different game, a co-op, every month. And, of course, there's all kinds of interesting stuff happening on the Amateur Hour Gaming channel as well. So to you, Dave, I just want to say thanks for uh, playing with me today. Anything you want to say before we go? Have a wonderful evening.